Hey guys, it's me, it's me, the Nintendo Sony Man here, welcoming you back to some more Let's Play Pokemon Yellow. In the last episode, episode, we defeated Brock. We got the Boulder Badge here, as you can see. Got about 2,000 Poke Dollars. Got some potions and Pokeballs. And we've got a yeah, pretty good level up team right here. We got Yusuke at level 11 and Kuwabara at level 12. So now, according to our map here, that I'm going to switch to the top. I said I'm going to switch the map to the top. Thank you. We are going to go... Not this again. Go up. We're going to go to Mount Moon. Alright, so first we're going to battle some of these guys, though. I started with one, so we're going to continue on. Hey, I met you in Viridian Forest. You did? Really? Yeah, I'm going to have to um, see you. Just, you know, for me to get reminded... Oh, wait. Wait a minute. I've... I might remember you, Bugcatcher. I might remember you. Let me see your team. Let me see your team. Ah, uh, mmm, maybe. I might have from... Actually, no, we've never seen this guy before. I don't know why they say that. Oh, I met you in Viridian Forest. Yeah, guess what? I also met, like, five other bug catchers. They all had a Caterpie. I, I can't really tell the difference anymore. If they had names, you know, maybe. But you're nothing special. <laughs> okay, so... Easy, just like that. Use kicking up to level 12. Gets a lot of speed. Oh, gets a good attack. And wow, this thing's actually could be close with the physical and special attacks. I'm, I'm impressed. All right, so he's gonna send out a Weedle. Um, I'm gonna switch into Kuabara here now. We may have to get a new team member. Actually, we will. I just don't know when. I mean, I guess I'll be fine with um. Pikachu, oh no. The Pikachu and Kuwabara for now. Jeez! Of course it would poison me. Of course it would poison me. Why wouldn't it poison me? Oh, come on. That's the thing with poison in this game. It's actually a lot more overpowered in... in first gen than in other generations. You can get poisoned just by simple poison states. Crazy. Caterpie... Eh, let me switch back into Yusuke. Great, now I have to go back, I have to get antidotes, I have to heal. And then I have to go back here. Thank you, Weedle, for wasting my time. I know it's only two minutes into the episode, but you know. Ah, critical hit, nice. Good job, Yusuke. You defeated the bug catcher. You beat me again! No, I haven't. I beat you for the first time. Do I have an antidote? Let me see. Of course not. Okay, well, I'm gonna go back and yeah. When the screen flashes like that, means your Pokemon is poisoned. And it does a weird glitchy thing with here. Actually, this is good. I'm gonna go to the market. At least I have a good amount of money. I have enough. Okay, we're gonna go here. I'm gonna buy three antidotes. We're gonna buy three potions. And that's it. I don't need an escape rope. I mean, escape rope's useful for obviously escaping from caves and that stuff, but I don't think I'm going to need it. can't believe I have to waste ha a lot of my time going back here to heal my Pokémon because I got poisoned by a simple poison sting. Can you believe that, guys? Okay. Well, I think we'll be fine with these two Pokémon for now. All right, now we can go on. I better not get poisoned by the next person that I fight because this will be the longest episode of me going back and forth, fighting and healing, fighting and healing. I don't want to do that, guys. I don't want to bore you like that. Okay, so let's check here again. Who's going to level up next? Let's see. 275. 56. Okay, use K, you're up first. Hi, I like shorts. They're comfy and easy to wear. Oh, well, okay. I mean, I like shorts, too. I mean, in the summer, it's really nice to have shorts on. 80 degree weather, you don't want to be walking around with pants and everything. So, youngster wants to fight. He has a rat attack. All the youngsters like shorts. I don't know what their obsession is with shorts. They always talk about the shorts, how it's the best fashion accessory the world has ever made. And yeah. 
Okay, they don't say it's the best, but they like shorts a lot. I mean, a lot. Oh, come on, oh, really? Tail Whip, you're gonna set up for another Ratata or something? Yeah, there's a reason you guys are, don't have any gym badges. I don't know. Ooh, an Ekans. Um. I will. Okay, I'll stay. All right, Ekans, a new Pokemon here. Ooh, looks cool. It's a poison type Pokemon. Ekans, interestingly enough, if you look at his name, is actually actually Snake spelled backwards. So that's pretty interesting. I actually like that about Ekans. And a lot of the Pokemon names like that, so... Oh, wow. That's Ekans is strong. He is strong. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, here's the move that I was hating. Oh, wow. Never mind. Okay, so Rap in this game is very overpowered. Once a Pokemon uses Rap, you can't do a thing until it releases you. Unlike in other games, later games, where you can actually try to move. But this one, it kind of sticks you in kind of a constant loop. You can't even choose. You can choose a fight, but you'll just keep getting wrapped until it releases you. However, use K grew to level 13, and wow, attack 21, speed 29, special 22. This is an odd Pikachu we have here. I don't believe it. I don't believe it either. I have a physical and special attacking Pikachu. That's kind of strange. Okay, let's switch down to Kuwabar and continue on here. I have a lot more trainers to fight. So let's fight this girl next. That look you gave me. It's so intriguing. I did not look at you! What is wrong? Well, I, I did, but I didn't at the same time. You're like that other girl down there is like, Oh, you looked at me, didn't you? <sighs> no, of course not. You looked at me or whatever. I don't know. All the glasses here are like, That look, it's so interesting. I'm curious. You seem like a mystery man. I don't know. Okay, so last one's the fight. And, oh jeez. We're doing this again. Ratataz. Ratataz. Ratata. It's like tap dancing or something. I don't know. Ooh, gets a quick attack off, but I'm going to destroy you with a low kick. Even though you're light as a feather. Okay, ooh, cool bars level 13. We are getting stronger here, guys. Attack 31. Oh my goodness. Speed 28, and everything else is horrible. Nidoran Mail. Okay, um... I'm, I'm gonna switch back into Yusuke here. Alright, so far, so good. Our team's actually looking pretty good. I mean, both level 13. This is kind of how I like having my Pokemon team kind of the same level-ish. Really balanced. Oh, thank goodness you failed, Lear. I don't want to be blinded in this episode, Nidoran. And wow, we're sweeping these guys like no one's business. Go, Yusuke! Be nice! It's a Pokémon battle! I'm not supposed to be nice. If you're so worried about me being mean, don't have Pokémon. Jeez. Okay, let's switch you two now. Okay. Now let's fight you. Are you a trainer? Let's fight! Obviously, I'm a trainer. I have a Pikachu with me. I've gotten this far. You, you, why would you think I'm not a trainer? <laughs> hey, look, another bug catcher. What do you have? Oh, uh, no, no. Weedle. Weedle. Oh, jeez. Please, do not poison me. Seriously, in this game, poison is like the most dangerous thing in the world. You get po you Poison sting happens, and you like 99.9% .9 of the time you will get poisoned. It's horrible. I hate it. I think they like it, they don't do that a lot in later generations. But I'm telling you, this game. Oh my goodness. There's a reason I believe that this. Wow, look at that Kakuna. That this game is one of the toughest Pokemon games there is. All right, Kakuna's evolution of um. We don't know if I mentioned this a lot. I hope this is an evolved Kakuna, because if it's not, then this trainer is not very smart. Wow, Yusuke, getting those critical hits. My team's gonna be like the critical team. <laughs> okay, so, eh, so far this guy's doing alright, but against Yusuke Urameshi, who just gets stronger after every battle like a Saiyan. Yeah, 
It's not gonna work. It's not gonna work. You're sending me bugs to electrocute. I don't think that's a very smart thing to do. Oh, look, it's a Metapod now, so we had the two types of bugs with him. Nice. However, that's not gonna help you that much. Good sir. Yeah, harden. Harden all you like. I'm just gonna electrocute you with how many volts of electricity. No amount of hardening is gonna help you with that. And now we're at level 14. Use K... Wow. You're fast. That's all you've got. That's, that's not really good, man. If I had new Pokemon, I would have won. We should have evolved them a bit further. It's not my fault. Can't train your Pokemon. Alright. Switch back here. I'm gonna jump down here to fight this guy. And then I'll keep going. Because I like fighting all the trainers. Hey, you're not wearing shorts. It's nearly winter now. Why would I be wearing shorts? It's like 50 degrees, out, 40 degrees outside. You want me to be wearing shorts like you? I'm not... I'm not impervious to the cold, youngster. He's got a Spira. Oh dear, that Spira's actually pretty tough. Oh uh, dear. Okay, gonna switch. <laughs> it's level 14. Spiro, pretty powerful. Oh, wow. I'm so lucky all these um, layers are missing or failing because I don't need to be blinded by my own game. Wow, whoa. Okay, that's weird. I've never seen Leer like, fail this much in a game, and wow. Yusuke, the critical king here, jeez, just <laughs> destroying everything. I don't even have its most powerful electric attack, attack, attack? I don't know. And I'm just destroying everything. Lost, 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 oh no, I'm lost, I don't know where to go. I don't have a GPS with me, I'm a horrible sense of direction. I'm a horrible sense of direction? Yes. He is a horrible sense of direction. Okay. Let's continue on, guys. Now that we fought these guys, it should be easy sailing. Smooth sailing. Okay, never mind. More battles! You can fight my new Pokémon. Ooh, we got some new Pokémon coming along. Alright, let's see what you got, Mr. Bugcatch. You got some evolved Pokémon for us? You might have some. Eh, uh... N n never, never mind. Okay, so you still have Caterpie. That that that's great. That that's beautiful. Nice. You know. Good old Caterpie, yeah. Level eleven Caterpie. Yeah. Okay, you know. Yeah. Ooh, a Metapod. I haven't seen one of those since last battle. Just wrong with I love how he says, I, we're gonna battle my new Pokémon, my new and improved ultimate Pokémon. Same Pokémon I fought for like the last how many episodes. Okay, I'm not gonna go through that again. There's gonna be a problem with training Cool Bar if I'm going up against Metapods. Harden. Harden. Well, harden against an electric jolt to your body. Sure. I don't know why Harden is, though, the move is... He's being covered by a square. I don't know how that's hardening. That's like enclosing yourself in a box. I don't know. But we defeated Bugcatch. Well, this is first gen. They were just learning this stuff. Done like dinner. <laughs> Actually, that's pretty accurate considering I was just frying your Pokemon with 100 million volts of electricity. It will be done like dinner. <laughs> Oh my goodness. I, I love some of the lines in this game, though. They are really funny. Okay, so we've got actually, yes, we have one more Pokemon battle here. I know so many battles. Eek! Did you touch me? Okay, seriously, what is wrong with these lasses? Look how far I am from her before she goes and sees me. She walks up to me and is like, Oh my god, did you touch me? Ah, oh no! What should I do? I mean... How could I have touched you? I'm like five feet away from you. You walked up to me. You touched me. Okay, let's get that clear. You touched me. I didn't even look at you. <laughs> Lass. These lasses, seriously. Oh no. It's Jigglypuff. The dreaded Pokemon from the anime that put everyone to sleep because it's trying to entertain everyone. Doesn't know its own power. Jigglypuff, the normal type Pokemon, known for Sing and known for being a very light Pokemon, actually. However, I'm about to defeat this thing and- oh no, oh thank goodness. 
Yeah, saying would not have been nice. Especially since Pokemon here are known to snooze for a very long time whenever it hears its voice. Luckily, Jigglypuff just fainted because I low-kicked the heck out of it. And I leveled up to level 14! Nice job, Quillbar. Attack 33. That is amazing for this point in the game. Jack defeated the lass. That's it? Well, you only had one Pokemon, and it happened to be a Jigglypuff. So, yeah. That's it. Let me talk to you again. Route 4 is at the foot of Mount Moon. Well, thank you for that. I, I couldn't have figured it out by going to my map, using it, and... No. Thank you. Doing this. Yeah. See? Route 4. Mount Moon. Awesome. Okay, that is actually the last battle we have. There is someone here... Oh, wait. Maybe not. Are you a battle? I forget. No, you're not. Phew. I better take a rest. Ugh. That tone from Cerulean takes a lot out of you. Yep. Route 3, Mount Moon ahead. Okay, so now we will finally make it to the base of Mount Moon. A lot of people are around here. Ouch! I tripped over a rocky Pokemon. Geodude! Okay, once again, how do you trip over a Pokemon? They only appear in caves and water and grass. Do you see a Geodude around here? Did you trip over it in Mount Moon? Maybe that's the thing. Because I thought, like, C was saying that C tripped over it out here. Now, let's go into this Pokemon Center, and if you've got enough money, you can get a pretty sweet deal here. I mean, seriously, one of the best deals you can get in the game. I'm not good at sarcasm, but... Yeah, it's a pretty good deal. You talk to this guy here. Hello there, have I got a deal just for you. I'll let you have a swell Magikarp for just 500 Boke dollars! What do you say, pal? What do you say, mate? Do you want a little good Magikarp? He's super powerful. He knows all these sorts of moves. He will be your best pal for the rest of your life. What do you say? Just 500 Boke dollars. Just 500 of those singles. Uh, what do you say? It's a one-time deal. What do you want? Yeah, sure, why not? And we got a Magikarp! Do you want a nickname Magikarp? Yes, I do! I'm going to nick this... nick... nick this guy... <laughs> what?! Nickname... <laughs> I'm going to nickname you... um... Ah, I know a good nickname. Karama. Yes. I'm going to nickname you, um... Karama. Kara... Yeah, Karama. However, if you talk to him again, well, I don't give refunds, because this swell, amazing, great Magikarp not only is at level 5, has 18 health, but look at its stats. It sucks. Attack 7. Special 7, really? I just wasted 500 Poké Dollars. Ain't no splash. The most useless move in all of Pokémon. Because it does literally nothing. When I was a kid, I actually thought Splash, um, I heard a rumor, I kid you not, that if you gave Magikarp fresh water, Splash would actually do something. It does nothing! So yeah, I gotta use this Magikarp. Yay. What do you have to say? Team Rocket attacks Cerulean citizens. Team Rocket is always in the news. Did I just hear about Team Rocket like a few seconds ago? Just look away from me. I have six Pokemon Pokeballs set in my belt. At most, you can carry six Pokemon. Yes, I know that. If you have too many Pokémon, you should store them via PC. It does that automatically, you nut muffin. Okay, I'm gonna heal here, and I'm gonna end it off here, because... I'm at 19 minutes here. I don't like my videos going any longer than 20 minutes. So I'm gonna end it off pretty soon here. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So let's get out of here. So next time on Let's Play Pokémon Yellow, we will take on... Um, Mount Moon to go to Cerulean City. It's been me, the Nintendo Soy Man, signing off, and I'll see you guys in more Pokemon Yellow. Say goodbye, Pikachu. Ah, uh, so cute. See you later.